Hamda Achroiso, Irinas Cardi, Aki Ceremony Radio, Privaskol Cardi. Good afternoon and welcome to the City of Cardiff and to the graduation ceremony of Cardiff University. I'm Dr. Chris Turner and it's with great pleasure that as University Director I welcome you all to today's graduation ceremony. We are here to celebrate our students' achievements and I am particularly pleased to welcome parents, family and friends to join in this celebration. I'm joined here on stage by the President's representative, the Vice-Chancellor, the academic staff and the Students' Union representative. The President's representative, Mr. Gethin Lewis, will formally open proceedings and the Vice-Chancellor, Dr. David Grant, will receive students to their award. To my left is Professor Paul Atkinson, the university's orator, and later he will introduce our honorary fellow. Honorary fellowships are awarded at our graduation ceremonies to those who have achieved great distinction in their field. And today we're honored to welcome Mr. Stanley Thomas. Students, today marks a marvelous milestone in your life, as it does in the lives of those who've supported you of the last few years. And it's good to see that so many of them are here today. I'm sure it will enhance your understanding and enjoyment of the day if we spend a few moments going through the procedures for the ceremony. Now for those of you receiving an award today, perhaps you thought that passing your exams was the biggest challenge in gaining your degree, but an even bigger challenge faces you today. You have still to cross this stage and shake hands with the correct person. <laughs> Try not to seek your award from anyone other than the Vice-Chancellor. A presenter will read out the names of the students being received to the same award. When each name is called, the student will ascend the stage, walk towards the Vice-Chancellor and shake his hand. Whilst past experience has shown this to be a little more challenging than it sounds, your approach to the stage and your return to your seat will be carefully guided by our specially trained marshals. So don't worry, once the ceremony is underway, it really is a case of follow the leader. When you leave the stage, you'll stand with your group facing the stage and the Vice-Chancellor will formally receive you to your awards. You will off in reply and you'll then be reseated by the marshals. When all awards have been received, students will be asked to stand to receive the university's greetings. Also and importantly, can I invite you to clap only after the Vice-Chancellor has admitted each group of graduates to their awards and not as each one crosses the stage. This will ensure that your hands are still in reasonable working order by the end of the ceremony. Finally, can I ask that you check to ensure that your mobile phone or other portable device is switched off, please. Enjoy the ceremony. Da, a croissoy naya dewi sant, our ceremony radio ama and a blue din to evila dinner deg. Good afternoon. It is my great pleasure to welcome you to St. David's Hall and to this, the final graduation ceremony this week. To overcome the formality of these caps and gowns, may I first introduce myself. I am Gethin Lewis and I have the honour of presiding at this ceremony as a member of Cardiff University Council. Congratulations to all of you who are graduating today. You have been successful in your studies and you have gained your rightful place in this afternoon's ceremony. <clears throat> all of you sitting here eagerly are waiting to be admitted as graduates of this prestigious university deserve congratulations several times over. Congratulations on winning admission in the first place 
all those years ago. Cardiff is one of the most sought after universities in the UK. Standards of admission are high. Selection, as you will probably remember, is extremely competitive. For every one of you sitting here, six or seven other applicants who are fighting keenly to be here instead of you. I said one of the most sought after universities in the UK. I should have said one of the most sought after universities in the world. Many of you have traveled great distances for the challenges and rewards of a Cardiff University degree course. Cardiff students are valued around the world for their skills, knowledge, and attitude. Congratulations on all you have achieved in your academic studies. Research-led teaching is one of the distinctive features of Cardiff University. Whatever you do in life, I hope that the free, inquiring Cardiff University state of mind will stay with you, whether you stay in academic research or pursue another career. <clears throat> you should also be congratulated for studying at the excellent four academic schools represented at this ceremony this afternoon. <clears throat> the Welsh School of Pharmacy is one of the premier schools of pharmacy in the UK and has a long record of distinction in the science and profession of pharmacy. Graduates of the school perform consistently well in the professional regulators qualifying examination. In 2010, graduates had a 98% success rate and were in the top three performing schools. <coughs> Many fellow <clears throat> pharmacy alumni have enjoyed prestigious careers. Five of your fellow past students have become presidents of the Royal Pharmaceutical Society of Great Britain. It could be your turn next. So just take some good Welsh water. <coughs> the School of Optometry <coughs> and Vision Sciences has an international reputation as a world-class school. The school is the only optometric training department in Wales, and students benefit from state-of-the-art facilities and excellent staff-student relationships. The School of European Studies is one of the largest and most dynamic schools of its type in the UK. The school provides a wide range of language programs, along with courses including politics, international relations, and translation studies. Students go on to careers in a wide variety of areas, including working in UK and European government institutions, business, and finance. My Escola Gymraeg and Escol Dynamic a llwyddiannus sy'n cynnig ymchwil ac addysgu o'r ansawdd uchaf. Mae myfyrwyr ar ei blwyddyn olaf yn cael cyfle i wybod am y ffyrdd y mae'r Gymraeg yn cael ei ddefnyddio mewn garfawdd gwahanol neu model arloesol, Cymraeg yn y gweithled. Mae'r ysgol hefyd wedi dyfarnu'r ysgol orau ymrhydain am astudiaethau Celtaidd the School of Welsh is a dynamic and successful school with research and teaching of the highest quality. The school has also been ranked the best in Britain for Celtic studies again this year, according to the Complete University Guide in the Independent. Congratulations on what you have brought to Cardiff and to Wales. 
In recent years, students have successfully combined study with setting up their own businesses. Your student concern has helped people at home and abroad. Your efforts have helped the homeless here in Cardiff and paid for clean water in Africa, amongst other good charitable causes. Your sporting contribution has been enormous. This year, Varsity was held for the first time at the Millennium Stadium. This was its 15th anniversary year, marking its progression as the pinnacle sporting event in the student calendar. Once again, Cardiff retained the Varsity Shield for the ninth consecutive year. Many of you will have taken part in Student Volunteer in Cardiff, one of the largest such schemes in the country. You've given more than 80,000 hours of your most pre precious commodity, your time. You are a prime reason why Cardiff University is so valued in its home community. Akinola, Llongabarchiadau i Ser a Ceremony Hon. Congratulations to you, the stars of this ceremony, on today becoming a worthy Cardiff University graduate. You've been successful in your studies and you've earned your rightful place at this ceremony. Around the world, Cardiff graduates are leaders in business, engineering, science, the arts, politics, and of course, culture. I know you will build on their achievements, even in these challenging economic times. There is one other group to be congratulated to. Parents, partners, and families. Congratulations not only on finding your way to this venue in our fine capital city, but also a sincere thank you for the invaluable support you have shown the, those graduating today. I am delighted that you've been able to join us and share in this very special ceremony. Before the formal proclamation to be read in Welsh and in English, I would like to remind all those graduating that this is not the end of your association with Cardiff University. It is, I hope, the beginning of a new one. Today, you join the worldwide family of Cardiff University alumni. It is a family that helps you stay in touch with each other and with us. I hope that you will remember and share your experiences that you'll come back to see us often and that you will continue to support us so new generations can benefit, as you have done, from the outstanding research, teaching and learning here at Cardiff University. Mwyn hewch ar y chlysur a gobeithio bydd y seremoni heddiw yn fyth gofiadwy i chi sy'n graddio ac hefyd i'ch taelu Ach Enjoy this occasion. Make it a truly memorable ceremony for you, your family, and friends. Thank you. Diolchen Vaur. I will read the proclamation first in Welsh and then in English. Ners gwlad ei gwybodaeth. Boed hysbys i holl y lodau'r brif ysgol ac ar hyd a lle y byd, fod cynulliad o brif ysgol Caerdydd yn cael ei gynnal heddiw ym mhrif ddinas Cymru. O dan awdurdod siarter frenhinol y brif ysgol, mae'r cynulliad hwn yn cyfarfod i dderbyn y myfyrwyr sydd yn rhinwedd ei hastudiaethau a'i hysgol heigdod, wedi haroli'n briodol yn unol ar statydau'r brif ysgol a gwedi cael yn deulo mwy graddau. Wrth ddathlu llwyddiant y rhai sy'n graddio yn y cynulliad hwn, fe i hatgoffwn o'i cyfrifoldeb i gyfrannu o werthoedd y brif ysgol hwn. Nod iddyn toi o ceisio, drwy eu cyflawniadau, wasanaethu ar lles pawb, yn drechu sicrhau rhagoriaeth ym mhob peth, 
ac yn boeni am ddyfodol yn byd. Gwran dewch yn awchus ar feithineb, gan ei fod yn cynnig gobaith a gwirionedd ym mhob cenhedlaeth. Nerth gwlad ei gwybodaeth, a nation's strength is in its learning. Let it be known to all members of the university and throughout the world that today in the capital city of Wales a congregation of Cardiff University is taking place. Under the authority of the university's royal charter, this congregation meets to receive those students who, by virtue of their studies and scholarship, have been appropriately examined according to the statutes of the university and found worthy of their degrees. We celebrate the success of those who graduate in this congregation and in doing so, remind them of their responsibility to share in the values of this university. It is for them to seek, through their achievements, to serve the common good, to strive for excellence on all things and care for the future of our world. Be attentive to wisdom, for it offers hope and truth in every generation. I, Professor Tim West, introduce those who have received the degree of Bachelor of Science. Georgina Allwood. Michael Bradbury. Elisa Joanne Broughton. Matthew Chan. Michelle Collier, Kate Cunningham, Katrin Ellery Davies, Jacqueline Dean, Tejal Devchan. Lindsay Doherty. Amy Downey. Yo Chong Yi. Thomas Daniel Fathers. Joel Ferrand. Daniel James Franks, Rashida Gunaranjan, Elizabeth Joy Hall, James Edward Herbert, Rebecca Hetherington. Good afternoon. At this point in the ceremony, and at other equivalent times, it is a tradition of the university for the Vice Chancellor to speak in Welsh to receive each group of graduates to their awards. The Welsh phrase I will use when translated means, through the authority conferred upon me by the university, I receive you to the degree which I will name and to all the privileges of that degree. Prwy a'r dyrdod a brifysgol a ymddyrriedwyd i mi derbyniach chwi i rath baglor man gwythoniau ag i holl ffyrrannu'r rath hon. Congratulations.
Emily Hodgkiss. Emma Holdy. Christian Anthony Hughes. Shazod Jafargoli. Magdalena James. James Jennings. Tristan Wynne Jones. Louise Jane Knight. Rachel Louise Kite. Krupali Keaton Lakhani. Craig Owen Lewis. Jean Yi Lu. David Lloyd. Owen Charles Lloyd. Robin Locke. Kieran Robert Gregory Loft. Natalie Lucas. Kelly Mayers. Teresa Christina Macalese. Trwy awdurdod a brifysgol a ymddyried gwyd i mi derbaniaf chwi i'r oedd baglo'r mewn gwythoniau ag i hoog ffyrrania rathon. Congratulations. Elizabeth Helen McCaffrey. Connor McCann. Daniel McGee. Claire McKay. Shivani Mehta. Charlotte Emma Meredith. Carol Josephine Messeder. Sana Michael. Bavika Mystery. Anika Jamal Nasir. Catherine Elizabeth O'Leary. Rebecca Oliver. Nimisha Patel. Ruchna Patel. Iveta Ivanova Pavlova. Emma Jane Pierce. Yong P. Chin. Richard Anthony Price. Bethan Emma Pugh. Rwy awdurdod a brifysgol a ymddyriedwyd i mi derbaniaf chwi 
Ira Baglor Mount with Donny I Zaki Hawk Burania Rahon. Congratulations. Rizwan Kadir. Tazlima Yasmin Kailum. Shweta Rabheru. Zara Rayman. Michael George Rogers. Shosu Lurik Rogers. Louise Claire Rowan. Nikita Nishit Shah. Philippa Sheldon. Laura Elizabeth Smith. Lydia Smith, Catherine Alice Stewart, Clark Stephen Tardiff, Samir Thacker, Catherine Walters. Sarah Catherine Warmisham. <laughs> Helen Louise Wilkins. Christine Wiley. Gemma Jade Wilton. Sophie Withers. Trwy awdurdod a brifasgol a ymbiriedwyd i mi, derbaniaf chwi i'r ffaglor mewn gwythoniau ac i holl ffyrannu'r rath hon. Congratulations. Professor Gary Baxter introduced those who have received the degree of Master of Pharmacy. Fatima Abbas. Sophia Abramchuk. Sosan Al Abdullah. Refka Al Meshedani. Sandra Anak Abbey. Myrna Assad. Widatala Awadala. Hanan Azu. Louise Tanya Barker. Jonathan Mark Bennett. Sarah Rhiannon Boyle. Catherine Denise Bradfield. Robert Matthew Challam.
Chen C. Chua. Louise Hugh May Chung. Laura Amy Clifford. Sarah Louise Connor. Elizabeth Ann Cook. Joshua Peter Coulson. Matthew James Courtney Smith. Rui a dyr dod a brifosgol a ymdyriaid hwyd i mi der baniaf chwi i roedd athro mewn ffyrwthiaeth ag i holl ffrania'r roedd hon. Congratulations. Gwyneth Heine Daniels. Lowry Rebecca Davis. Purvi Hitesh Kumar Dodia. Victoria Duff. Richard Colin Draper. Emma Evans. Richard Mark Foster. Reese Thomas Gallagher. Siobhan Breed Gleason. Colette Griffiths. Lloyd James Hambridge. Tom Allen Hardy. Francis Ruth Harwood. Daniel Rees Hay. Charlotte Hill. Samara Hussein. Adebemi Sola Ibidapo. Matthew Owen Ivory. David Gareth Edward Jackson. Anwen Meyer James. Rwy a dyrdod a brifosgol a ymdyriaid hwyd i mi derbaniaf chwi i roedd athro mewn ffyrwthiau ag i holl ffrania'r roedd hon. Congratulations. Christy James. Helen Elizabeth Jarvis. Noor Adel Karim Jemma. Hannah Joanne Jones. 
Sarah Jane Joseph. Farah Kassam. Zayad Kalaf. Afia Ibrahim Abdelkader Karouf. Andrew James Kings. Emily Knight. Helai Pusha. Jessica, Jessica Llewellyn Lewis. Rhiannon Lloyd. Ruby Chung Wan Lo. Catherine Gemma Lo. Hamish Lunagaria. Holly Louisa Margaret MacDonald. Catherine Elizabeth Maguire. Abigail Louise McGaw. Boudica Samanmali Mohitige Don. Ruiau dyr dod a brifysgol a ymdyried hwyd i mi derbaniaf chwi i raf athro man ffyrwylliau ag i holl ffrania'r raf hon. Congratulations. Stacey Louise Mould. Alan Morgan. Sarah Mulholland. Rachel Lauren Nielsen. Kate North. Rhys Oakley, Sundeep Patel, Laura Peart, Ryan Lee Power, Jonathan James Price, Sira Rafiq, Darani Danela Ratnaraja, Jonathan Peter Rees, David Thomas Richards, Sarah Caris Rogers, Rebecca Ross. Hansil Ryu, Haley Sarbats, Natalie Louise Savage, Artie Shah, Rwy awd i'r dod a brifysgol a ymddiriedwyd i mi derbaniaf chwi i raf athro man ffyrwylliau ac i holl 
Franja Rathan. Congratulations. Rushab Jitesh Shah, Shinal Shah, Srina Shah, Emily Louise Shanahan, Rumina Kaur Shakur. Sital Siani, Paul Sagokon, Kirsty Jane Spearman, Elizabeth Rose Stevenson, Rian Francis Streak. Zara Tanweer, Sarah Margaret Tarpey, Claire Taylor, Nicola Ann Trenchard, Peter Rodri Joseph Venables. Catherine Wynne Walters, Anne Marie Catherine Watts, Kate Lauren Weston, Jennifer Ann Williams, Lisa Meyer Winston. Izati Yusuf, Trui out here start a provasco and their yet wheat in me, their banyev hui, Iroth Athroman Ferusiai. Aki Hoch, Franja Rathon. Congratulations. I, Professor David Voucher, introduce those who have received the degree of Bachelor of Arts. Charlotte Emily Chetland. David Rees Callas. Adam Clements. Charlotte Jones. Amy Elizabeth O'Brien. Emma Louise Roberts. Daniela Sims. Victoria Louise Smith. Sadie Alice Taylor.
Michael Troll. Helen Elizabeth Stormberg Charlotte. Emma Margaret Falloy. Jonathan Paul Stogden. Alexander Gerald Thackra. Rebecca Elizabeth Jones. Rebecca Gillian Thomas. Sarah Crealisi. Sarah Catherine Francis Curthoys. Jessica, Jessica Dixon. Matthew Samuel Ellison. Sophie Ann Thomas. Melanie West. Rebecca Wood. Sally King. Ruia dir dod a brifasgol a ymddiriad hwyd i mi der baniaf chwi i radd baglor yn y celfyd dat dau ag i holl ffrenia'r radd hon. Congratulations. Matthew Tomlinson. Kathleen Wright. Nicola Jean Kopelman. Ruth Corker Lurio Norte. Rachel Annie Badger. Rachel Louise Bloom. Natalie Bradfield. Daniel Ellery. Emily Ruth Evans. Emma Harris. Sophie Hay. Stephanie Howells. Toby Paul Jarvis. Gwenthlian Jones, Alison Ruth, Ruth McTiffin, Emma Jane Potter, Jennifer Ann Rankin, David Hugh Reeves. Claire Victoria Richardson. Katie Sandow. 
Catherine Smith. Emma Louise Titley. Martin Anthony Paul Belfrage. Rwy a dyrdod a brifysgol a ymderiedwyd i mi, der baniaf chwi i'r baglor yn y celfyddydau ac i holl ffrenio'r rath hon. Congratulations. Maya Maxwell. Scott Scrivens. Sarah Stimson. Sophia Rhiannon Davis. Hannah Louise O'Connor. Tobias de Carteret, Dan David Harris, Renata Nandi Leco, Alison Rachel Muse, Gareth James Crossy. Elizabeth Blewett, Sarah Alexandra Jackson, Christopher Carter, Eva Fabiana Milkarich. Ariane Ruth Sherry. Jessica Robin Brewer. Barbara Novak. Catherine Smith. Claudia Hutchinson. Kerry Elizabeth Blunt, Nia Half Bowen, Alistair Downs, Kelly Marie Evans, Rwy a dyrdod a brifysgol a ymderiedwyd i mi der baniaf chwi i'r oedd baglor yn y celfyddydau ac ei holl ffrenio'r roedd hon. Congratulations. Emma Giannini. Liat Goldfarb. 
April Rose Howells, Magda Anna Lusinka, Rebecca Catherine Merrick, Nicola Jane Mumford, Thomas Allen James Nash, Abigail Penny, Matthew Simon Spur, Celia Weller, Stephen Young, Laura Jane Parler, Adam C. S. Barr, Timothy Sylvester Bergman, Alexander Betridge Saunders, Henry Davis, Lucy Catherine Gillias, Philippa Victoria Lewis, Rebecca Cluellen, Alice Josephine McCaskey, Alexander Maitland, Madalena Rebecca Whitcomb, Truiaut is dot a prevasco, and the retweet in me, der baniev hui, irav baglor and a calvadadai, aki hor, frania rathon. Congratulations. Laura Lacey, Madalena Sarah Maxwell Hart, Bethan Hannah Aston, Holly Bigwood, Emily James Jane Davis. Deborah Edwards, Emma Rachel Gogol, Hannah Gregory, John Hooper Nash, Laura Jane Lloyd. Francesca Monaco, Patrick Regan, <laughs> Helena Rose Theodosia Woodland, Thomas Bellis, Alexi Fromagio, Lauren Mary Godfrey, James Goodeve Ballard, Bianca London,
Sabina Morgan Richards, Christopher John Bufton, Graham Ross, Gemma Vidal Matthewman, Dear Dod Abrivaskol, and the Rietweed in me, Der Bania Hui, Ira Baglor and a Calvada die, Aki Hor, Frania Rathon. Congratulations. I, Professor David Boucher, introduce those who have received the degree of Bachelor of Economic and Social Studies. Mary Abusida Akrinsola, Rachel Belmonte, Hannah Bolton, Callum John Brennan, Sophie Gale, Hannah Elizabeth Head, Stephanie Nicole Hislop. Vesa Matty. Kahilumpi Dominic Keyhat Mariam Nagi Lama Sanko Richard Thomas Matthew James Vanstone, Christina Ivanova Jordanova, Robert Cooper, Natalie Hanley, Fiona Laird. Ram Menon, Faye Lydia Phillips, Megan Rosa Reese, Katie Taylor, Petra Vakalova, Nicholas Gary Bond, Daniel Cloellen Broccoli, Jordan Louise Brooks. Through our dear dot a brivascal, a amter yetweet, a me, der banyev hui, irath baglor maunastid yethai, economai the hamde thassol, a gay hoch, frania rathon. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. 
Alexander Henry Philip Bywater. Craig Dark. Adam Bledon Evans. Elizabeth Floyd. Henry George Edward Guy. Jack Anthony Hansen. William Haywood. Philippa Amy James. Gemma Louise Kay. Edmund Blowcock. Jessica Elizabeth Matthews. Joshua William Miles. Tom Narbra. Sean Christopher Perks. Rosalind Platt. Junil Ramesh. Chloe Smith. Oliver James Smith. Oliver Benedict Townsend. Jessica Warren. Stephanie Ellen H. Warren. Adam Richard Waite. Matthew Weeks. Stephanie Witts. Christopher Wood. Trwy a dyrdod a brifasgol a ymddiriedwyd i mi derbaniaf chwi i roedd daglo'r mewn astudiaethau, economaeth a chymdeithasol ac i holl ffrenia'r roedd hon. Congratulations. Soahib Khan, Hugh Proctor, Anthony Town, <coughs> Catherine Woodcock, Richard Arnold. Amit Pal Haujla, Thomas Joseph Barr, Jessica Blair, Hugo Joseph William Brennan, Charlotte Bufton. Rebecca Ann Colloran. Robert Craig. Claire Evans. Harry Green. J. 
Jack Edward Henry. Jonathan Morris. Bethan Perkins. Thomas Edward Scriven Baker. David Graham Steed. Lawrence Waller. Benjamin Wild. Geraint Martin Williams. Alexandra Eusebi. Miriam Sophie Luschner. Felicity Jane Slater. Congratulations. Sean Davis and Kavrino High Sid Wedi Derbin Grav, Baglor, and a Kelver the Dai. Alice Fion Beatson. Nia Rebecca Broderick. Kerry Brunelli. Danielle Marie Cowley. Alau Davis, Mary Daniel, Keris Edwards, Ellen Lloyd Ellis, Dewi Allen Fox. Carwin Sean George. Kellyanne Greentree. Nia Wynn Hopton. Mared Ellen Hughes. Lucy Jones. Neil Jones, Laura Lee, Catherine Mai Lewis, Owain Fries Lewis, Canan David Lloyd. Rwy a dirdod a brifasgol a ymddiriaid hwyd i mi derbaniaf chwi i'r roedd baglor yn y celfyddydau ac i hoch ffrania'r roedd hon. Clwng fach hiadau. Congratulations.
Anwen Hevin Mathias. Katie Ann Louise McFenton. Caroline Elizabeth McManus. Jane Dillis Price. Fionn Harve Pritchard. Bronwen Mai Elizabeth Rickard. Kerry Shore, Caddy Mai Squires, Alex Thomas, Caris Thomas, Catherine Hannah Thomas. Fionn and Harrod Williams. Glyn Thomas Wise. Hannah Wynne Williams. Helev Mai Brooks Jones. Gwen Sheehan Edwards. Karen Gregory, Rian Elizabeth Thomas, Trui out your dot a privasco and their yet wheat in me. Der Baniev Hui, Ira Baglor and a Calvet that die, Age Hof, Frania Rathom, Longavach Yadai. Congratulations. I, Professor Tim West, introduce those who have received the postgraduate diploma. Simon Dibbon. Bethan Sarah Jones. Matthew John Lizakowski. Hetal Panchmatia. Ivana Kai Shuan Yong. Pruyat ir dod a brifasgol a amderiad wyd i mi der baniaf chwi i the ploma ol rhythetig ag i hoch ffyrannu'r rath hon. Congratulations. I, Professor Tim West, introduce those who have received the degree of Master of Arts. Alexandra Letitia Baines. Catherine Turner. Julia Christine Burkhardt. And Jeska Kravchek. Victoria Jane Leonard. <whistles> Russell Ann Trevenin Jones. 
Wing Young Victoria Wong. James Christian Cope. Annie Clean Parry. William Doiver Parry. Trwy awdurdod a brifysgol a ymdyriad hwyd i mi, derbynu ar chwi i roedd athro yn y celfyddydau ac i hoch ffyrrannu'r roedd hon. Congratulations. I, Professor Tim West, introduce those who've received the degree of Master of Economic and Social Studies. Marianthi Dunn. Catherine Wynne Edwards. Asmab Asif. Michael Edmund Borger Handler. Megan Elizabeth Coftry. Paul James Davies. Owen Michael Dole. Monica Ilui Emanuele. Richard Peter Gale. Katie Elizabeth Harris. David Arwen Hughes. Emma Jones. Jennifer Lynn Jones. Bethan Jane Judge. Gary John Hammond Kenning. Kate Kilner. Katarina Marchek. Maria Margarita Partakis. James Gareth Stewart. Cynthia Luesi Super Oraji. Art Jan Van der Viles. Rianeth Janine Williams. Angus Charles Shields. Andrea Eliotti. Sam Benham Powell. Trwy awdurdod a brifysgol a amdyriad hwyd i mi, derbyniaf chwi, I roedd athro mewn astudiaethau, economaeth a chymdeithasol ac i holl ffrenio'r roedd hon. Congratulations. I, Professor Tim West, introduce those who have received the degree of Master of Science. Caroline Bernice Mary Brown. Victoria Green.
Rowena Lewis. Alison Claire Brooke. James Alexander Campling. Alexandra Evliava. Lindsay Claire Judd. Dominique O'Neill. Karen Pearson. Stephanie Chakour. Melike Digger. Sigurda Helgi Iverson. Jacqueline Ann Jones. Roslise Binti Lagis. Barbara Cornelia Polek. Andrea Claire White. Truy a dyr dod a brifasgol a ymddiriedwyd i mi der baniaf chwi i raf athro mewn gwythoniau ag i hoch ffrangio'r raf hon. Congratulations. I, Professor Tim West, introduce those who have received the degree of Doctor of Philosophy. Nadine Oar. Reem Kalaf Al Essa. Mana Alafri Alanazi. Saud Ahmed Alanazi. Anish Alex. Frankie Asari Donko. Balinja Kaur Baines. Lynn Carol Bollington. Christoph Andrea Kasselberg. Yen Po Chen. Golam Hossein Fazandi. Kinga Elizabeth Hansel. Alexander David Henson. John Andrew Jones. Hakemi Kadri. Junichi Kasuga. Trwy awdurdod a brifasgol a ymddiriedwyd i mi derbaniaf chwi i raff doethau'r mewn a throniau ac i hoch ffrangio'r raff hon. Congratulations. Lillian Kisizwa.
Michael Roy Longman. Ali Mohammed Masmali. George McMahon. Shimon Magalski. Matthew Cameron Murray. Catherine Louise Nasserian. Barbara Paulina Polka. Paulina Samsel. Ashley Ann Weeks. Noah Ibrahim Al Said Zaidan. Truly out is dod a brivascol, a under yet wheat e me, der baniaf hui, e rath doither mauna thronii, agi hof, frania rathon. Congratulations. I, Professor Tim West, introduce those who have received the degree of Doctor of Science, Brian Kenneth Evans. Dr. Brian Evans is awarded the degree of Doctor of Science for a body of work conducted over more than 35 years on the design and clinical use of novel formulation systems to treat gastrointestinal diseases. Brian graduated as a Bachelor of Pharmacy from the Welsh School of Pharmacy in 1963. After pre-registration training, his first position was as Deputy Chief Pharmacist at St David's Hospital, Cardiff. His research career began in 1970 when he undertook pharmacological studies on the smooth muscle relaxing properties of plant essential oils. This research developed over several years while he was registered as a PhD candidate in the school and working at the Heath Hospital. The work resulted in the development of a novel enteric coated capsule formulation of peppermint oil for the treatment of irritable bowel syndrome. His PhD was awarded in 1980, and in addition to this academic success, the capsule formulation was patented and became a clinical and commercial success. Not many hospital pharmacists drive to work in a Lotus car. Brian's entire career as a hospital pharmacist has been distinguished by his research, often undertaken in close collaboration with gastroenterologists and surgeons. This research has encompassed a range of studies related to the actions and formulations of many therapeutic drugs for a range of gastrointestinal diseases. This has resulted in the publication of more than 100 papers and patents. The work can truly be said to be translational in its nature. Many thousands of patients will have benefited directly from the research undertaken by Brian and his clinical colleagues. The research has been recognised by many awards and markers of esteem. They include the Evans Medical Research Award, election to the membership of the Committee of the Safety of Medicines, and the inclusion of two of his novel formulations as British pharmacopoeia monographs. The award of the Senior Doctorate by the University is the highest academic recognition of his substantial and highly original contributions to the advancement of knowledge.
Rhwi a dirdod y brifysgol a ymddiriedwyd i mi der baniaf chwi i radd doethyr mewn gwythoniaeth ag i hoch ffrania'r radd hon. Congratulations, Brian. now invite all of you who have received your awards this afternoon to stand so that you can receive the greetings of the President's representative, Mr. Gethin Lewis, and the representative of the Students' Union, Mr. Darrell Light. Please stand. <coughs> a lles ein byd. May your care ever be for the good name of our university and the well-being of our world. You are now members of the Distinguished Alumni of this university. May your association with the university be cherished and be constant throughout your life and may your care ever be for the fellowship of our university and the welfare of all people. Now, before you sit down, I'm sure that all you very proud graduates would like to join in a long-standing tradition at Cardiff University at these ceremonies, and that is to pay a special tribute to your families and friends who have supported you in so many ways over many years, not least financially, and indeed to thank the academic staff who have helped you reach this important point in your life today. Can I therefore invite you to turn around to greet your family and friends and say a special and public thank you by giving them all an enthusiastic round of applause. Thank you, and please be seated. Vice Chancellor, it's my very great privilege and pleasure to present Sir Stanley Thomas as an honorary fellow of Cardiff University. Who ate all the pies, Vice-Chancellor? Well, I suppose I did. And generations of students have been sustained by such staples as pie, beans, chips, in various combinations. But who made all the pies? Well, not directly. Sir Stephen and his family did, or at least a great many of them. Sir Stanley's family came from Merthyr Tydfil, where his father, who is with us in the hall today, had a bakery business, Stan Thomas Limited. Leaving school at 15, Sir Stanley joined the business, where he was sales manager and then production manager. That business was sold in 1965 to a Cardiff-based company, and Sir Stanley remained with them until 1970. He left in 1970 and together with members of his family, including his brother Peter, he founded Peter's Savoury Products, manufacturers of the famous Peter's Pies. The company grew, employing at its peak 1,300 staff. That business was sold to Grand Metropolitan in 1988. Sir Stanley then turned his talents to property investment founding the company that was to become TBI. Amongst its holdings were Cardiff and Belfast airports, and with the acquisition of Airport Group International, 
the company became a major owner-operator in the business. That business was sold in 2005. So Stanley has made a huge difference to life in Wales, not only as an employer, but as a leader in numerous charities. He has been chairman of the NSPCC in Wales and, most notably, chairman of the Noah's Ark Appeal that raised over £9 million to date to create the new children's hospital for Wales here in Cardiff, the final phase of which is due for completion in 2014. Sir Stanley continues to serve as president for that appeal and other notable charitable activities include the Prince of Wales Trust, St John's Ambulance, MenCap and Parkinson's Disease in Wales. Sir Stanley and his wife Lady Shirley Thomas have made personal donations to charity and in support of medical research. Sir Stanley has a personal interest in supporting research into rheumatoid arthritis. Sir Stanley has been, as you can imagine, the recipient of many honours. Among them, he has been made an officer of the Order of St John of Jerusalem and is a freeman of Merthyr Tydfil. He was awarded an OBE in 1994 and in 2006, Her Majesty the Queen knighted him. We, Cardiff University, are delighted to add our own recognition by making him today a fellow of our university. Andr Dedes Iskan Hechlor, Kavluina of E.T. Sir Stanley Thomas, Vel Kamraud Arand Radev, Privazgol Cardi. Dear Dada Rothwood in me, Gana Kangor, Der Banya Hui, Fel Kamrauder and Rada, Rivaskal Kairdith. Welcome to the Chancellor, honoured guests, ladies and gentlemen, this truly is a wonderful honour, a very special privilege to be made an honorary fellow of Cardiff University and join the ranks of such distinguished people from many walks of life who have been similarly recognised since honorary fellowships were introduced here over 30 years ago. I have looked up a few statistics about the university and quite honestly I was astonished to learn that there are more than 28,000 students and 600 staff based at Cardiff University and incidentally I have to sell pies to all of those <laughs> and each year more than 8,000 students graduate from this wonderful university. These are significant figures and they indicate the tremendous contribution being made by Cardiff University in the field of higher education. Another fact that impressed me is that Cardiff University is the first choice amongst the highest calibre of students, not only in Wales, but indeed the rest of the United Kingdom and many other countries around the world. And consequently, there are approximately 34,000 applications for just 4,500 places annually. You who graduate today 
leave with the advantage of a first-class education, which has provided the personal and intellectual skills now being demanded by employers. And this will give you a flying start in beginning your chosen careers in what are particularly competitive and challenging times. However, I am sure with the benefits of Cardiff University has given you, you will succeed. All of us here today who have received honours are, of course, very privileged. Privileged that we've had wonderful parents and wonderful family who have supported us from a very young age and given us the opportunity to achieve what you in particular have achieved today. You also must feel privileged to have been educated here at this wonderful University of Cardiff. You heard that uh, my father is here with me today, like so many of your parents. My father is 94. I left school without any academic qualifications. I decided one day at 15, school wasn't for me. I'm off home, which I did fully expecting the following day to be marched back. And my father at the time in Merthyr Tidville at a small bakery and a couple of uh, vans delivering meat pies through the valleys, the towns, and the cities of Wales. And his first words were to me, great, you start tomorrow. <laughs> I thought I'd had a couple of days off, but when I tell you it was indeed in those days, seven days a week, and we worked 10, 12 hours a day. But I had an education, second to none, sitting down next to my dad, who taught me not only the art of selling, but the art of business in general. My mother was also very much a part of our business. And the one thing they taught me which has always remained with me and which is so important. No matter how well you do or in how well you don't do, there's always going to be someone out there worse off than yourselves. So in whatever way you can as you grow older, you make sure you do something to help those who are less fortunate than yourself. I've been privileged in being successful uh, in my business life, but to be honest, the greatest achievement I've had is the creation of jobs, not only in Wales and the UK, but indeed throughout four continents, creating thousands of jobs, and that gave me great satisfaction. But even more so, the financial gains that I was able to make through my business acquisitions and uh, all the time that I worked with some wonderful people, I've been able to support so many different charities and just as important, so many individuals. Individuals who live within our community, who have come to an age in life where most of their families are more or less gone and they're on their own. I'd like to leave you with one thought today. You were starting out on life. You've all got your ambitions. And I feel that you must always remember this. Please look around you Notice the people that need your support and help. It doesn't have to be monetary. You can knock on a door, see an elderly person or a sick child, and give them some time and comfort. And if you do that throughout your life, you will find you'll have more satisfaction than anything else that you will have achieved in life. Give something back, please. 
to those most in need. I know that, I understand you have uh, uh, student volunteer in group in Cardiff who have indeed helped the elderly, the young and the disadvantaged. So, so many of you have already been doing that. So please carry on throughout your life and continue that way. If I might, may finish by just saying, I feel deeply privileged to have been made an honorary fellow and I shall always strive to be a worthy advocate and ambassador for Cardiff University in the years to come. Thank you. As a member of the Cardiff University Council, it's now my duty to draw this final graduation ceremony to a close. My achlasir hun an ino rai muiav pleseris ang halender a brivescol. This occasion is naturally one of the most pleasurable in the university calendar. It's been a joy and a privilege to be on this platform today and to see the pride and relief of all new graduates. It's also been very enjoyable to witness the expressions of happiness and even greater relief on the faces of your families and friends as they proudly watched you graduate today. As this is the final graduation ceremony this week, I would like to thank all the staff involved, both academic and administrative, for the efficient organisation of these graduation congregations. I hope it is now safe to say that this has been the 13th such ceremony during the past week, that everything has gone smoothly. I'm pleased that the Vice-Chancellor's wrist has survived over 7,000 handshakes, and I must continue to congratulate him on his excellent Welsh pronunciation. It's wonderful, to, too, that you've had the opportunity to share this occasion with today's illustrious honorary fellow, Sir Stanley Thomas, one of Wales's most successful entrepreneurs and prominent philanthropist, and his message to you to look out for those who are worse off than we are. As you now go as graduates into the world, I hope you take with you happy memories of your time at Cardiff University and in the capital city of Wales. Confidence that your studies have been a valuable contribution to your lives so far and a determination to use your qualifications, skills and talents in the service of humanity to make our world a better place. On behalf of Cardiff University, your academic staff, the officers, your fellow students, and the great family of alumni throughout the world, I wish you all every success and happiness in the future. Pob hapisroedd a llwyddiant i chi gyd yn y dyfodol. Good luck. Pob luck. Enjoy the rest of this extra special day. Mwyn hewch. Diolch yn fawr a siwrnedd ddiogel adre. Thank you and a safe journey to you all home.